All right, what's up, what's happening, Captain? It's Granny Cantu and this bitch. And today I have a brand new episode of Antique Accoutrements. It's been years since I did one of these videos, but basically I feel like hitting some antique stores. I wanna find some decor for my apartment and all of that jazz. So that basically is what will be happening, Captain, today. Um, quite possibly the coolest shop ever. Yeah, we'll see if they really live up to their uh, chalk rating expectations outside the store. Also, there's a pop-up this weekend in houston all the infos in the description um vintage hip hop flea market in houston texas pull up this sunday is going down here in texas houston Barbara. oh my gosh the ambiance is lovely in here Ooh. look at this little custom globe lamp oh my gosh with all the little trill frill and other little accoutres hanging down this is glorious absolutely glorious Sophisticated. Oh god, dude, I'm about to like knock something over. I just trip, um, tripping, tripping. But yeah, they have a lot of vintage clothes, but more for the, the women's. You know what I'm saying? Um, but who knows? I could young thug it and put on a little dress or two. Oh yeah. But the patterns are absolutely beautiful. Oh my god. And they got the, the camera section just snapping. A Polaroid, immaculate. Look at the flash on that guy. Oh my gosh! Shout out, Lil Kodak. Well, you know that it's Lil Kodak. You already knew that shit. This is a very cool shop. I'm not gonna lie. And I also like all the cool little lamps hanging down. Yeah, I'm really gonna get into my interior decorator bag up in here, boy. Just know that. Oh my God. Wait, what does it say? Mint rare display. Original Looney Tunes Polaroid. Okay, so this is probably the one piece that is like my vibe for sure and it's clean with Tweety's big ass head shout out Tweety too man non little binary gender specific bird all right we're out of there um in an attempt to not look like a total creep i asked the lady if i could record and she's like oh record the outside of my store so boom there it is if you guys saw anything in there that struck your fancy pull up on her she's a nice lady nice silver fox rare um but anyways on to the next so we jumped into another store and why oh because the fan i was like yo it looks like this light is like tweaking sorry if any of you guys have like light induced seizures from strobes but i don't know what type of creature this is but he is a sophisticated um possibly asian mammalian species so yeah i'm gonna get this dude from my crib made me look cultured it's five bucks but yeah this is like the only thing i found in here aside from a ton of creepy dolls and there's a lot of them literally around every corner Oh hell no. This really scared me. Oh my god, this dude looks like he's off Planets of the Apes and she's not phased. All right, so um, I just jumped out of the store where I got that weird lemur thing, which we determined was like a sloth, I guess. But I also, Jesus God, picked up this little Samsonite mini suitcase thing um, because I have suitcases just stacked in my crib and I thought this little mini one would look cool because I have like two giant ones and then a normal size one. Um, it also has like a broken lid. So this could be used as like, I guess a weapon or something. And then I may just plant plants in the other half of the suitcase. So a little $5 acquisition, not too shabby. All right, just jumped into Goodwill and um, they have this like bootleg Arthur, like the old rendition um, with a paintbrush. He got a little drizzle under his mouth. But look at the expression on this bird's face. Life is not facing him, and he's just pushing this dude to the side. Whoa, what's happening there? Oh, slap it, tap it. Hey, the best team to be on is Team Head. Nasty. Oh, Lord, hell yes. And they got the pearl colored bag to match it. What is this? <laughs> oh, holler. Yeah, they got this cool little guest USA tee. It's like super stretchy. You got the little question mark on it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grab this. Just look at the texture. Another thing will feel good draped over thine skin. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, uh, mira. Paco and the Ritons homes. Vatos locos forever, carnal. Orale. All right, yo, they got a couple more little t-shirts. They got this dude straight sacrificing homeboy. Got a still beating heart about to roll down the pyramid steps. Got a whole little ceremony and seance happening on the front and back. Little Cozumel tourist tee. It's pretty interesting. 
And then they also have this cool little brand new with tags like 90s tea by a tomato brand or tomato. Depends on how you enunciate it. Originally 12 bucks, now for the low price of six. Made in USA. Not single stitch in this bitch. I think it looks like a croc skin though. Yo, holy guacamole, yo, peep at this little orange find. Made in USA, vintage Nike tee. Nike little logo on the front. And then on the back side, who lord. Checks over stripes, yeah, that's what I like. Yeah. That's what we Um, what is this? Oh my god. Bruh. They have the little dueling dragon tees by the mountain 2001. Shout out to boy Nico John. Bro. Straight up dragon slayers and dragon tamers going at it with the bows and arrows on these little flying reptilians. Damn, look at those talons. Do the chickens have large talons? Do they have what? Large talons. Yo, man, I'm actually thoroughly breast. Wow, breast? Excuse me. I'm thoroughly blessed and impressed by this store. I just found this little starter. Look at that, man. Wait, hold on. Where are you at? I'm a man like a star boy. Um, little Canadians jersey. This thing just like hopped out of nowhere and I was very, very impressed with it. Um, starter made in Korea. It has this big old patch on the front. Very cool. And there also is the Harvard Business School on the champion little um, blank. So another one, shout out that boy Lil Pump. Honorable graduate from Harvard. Man, someone's granny went above and beyond at the little weekly art club meeting. Just check out the detail, man. Five sequins per, and yes, they are golden. Nice little gold. floral outlines with the gold puff paint, and they weren't lacking with the Made in USA Fruit of the Looms best tag. Oh wow, then right above it's Granny's shoe. Nice! Look at this, we got one last little bonus find. This uh, Honey Dijon Mustard Hybrid yeah. Colored yeah. Teapot. <laughs> All right, class, in or out of there. Look at this shit. All right, um, yeah. So, got some little, got some little stuff at the Goodwill. <laughs> got some stuff at the antique stores. Let's go back and see all the scores. All right, guys. So we're back right now um, with all of the things I got at the two antique stores and the one Goodwill I went to. Um, all right, so basically before we get into the finds to conclude this video, I just want to tell you guys again, I have a pop-up this weekend in Houston, Texas. I'm going to be doing a meet and greet selling a bunch of clothes. So everyone in Houston pull up. I also have some really unique things that I'm going to be selling at my pop-up at the Vintage Hip Hop Flea Market. Again, all the info is in the description of this video. So if you guys would show out, show love, there are a ton of vintage vendors, a ton of break dancers, people rapping. It's just a really cool vibe, a lot of different food and um, other things that you guys can try over your body and having your crib that are all vintage dope and hip-hop related now um so that is this weekend which is april 7th april 20th i'm gonna be doing a pop-up in new york city for everyone out there and then april 27th i'm gonna be doing a pop-up in denver colorado at sneaker con so anyone in those areas just keep that in mind we got a lot of stuff going on now um some of the finds that i got today this is gonna be in no particular order i mean you guys saw a lot of the things that i grabbed the little Harvard T right here, business school. I just love that it's on a champion frame and is a business school. The colorway on this all over print, little Cody and Cozumel T is definitely um, glorious. And then this guest T is a clean little essential. I just love the little question mark and the stretchiness of the material. Um, this piece is what actually surprised me is the starter hockey jersey, all embroidered and very, very nice. Now, um, getting into the last little tease that I got, of course, I grabbed the uh, little Dragon Slayer and Dragon Tamer tee right here. I just love the print on this, and these shirts are gonna be for sale at the pop-up. Anyone online at Vintage website, thriftheadvintage.com, which also will be having stuff on there. Um, the OG Made in USA Nike tee, definitely a nice little essential. And then I didn't really talk about this too much because I was in line and got distracted, but I grabbed this um, teapot right here. And this is actually like a Lance Armstrong Live Strong. I don't know, that's random little teapot collab. I just got it because I like the color and I guess I'm gonna be brewing some tea um, to enhance my life fucking expectancy. Um, and then the little accoutrements, again, that I got for the crib is this little lemur monkey, which I think will look really dope on the shelf that's like behind me. So shout out little homie right here. He's $5, just ceramic, 
something cool. And then the last piece I got, which you guys saw, was that little Samsonite suitcase. Boom, this dude right here. And um, this guy actually I'm gonna stack on my other suitcases. And this is exactly what I mean by that. So I have a lot of plants, suitcases, and just stuff interacting um, in that little corner of my house. So yeah, that's why I buy these dudes, despite this one being broken. But yeah, man, a lot of antique stores were closed today, so I think I'm actually gonna do some more like antiquing slash interior decor videos in the future. So stay tuned for that, but uh, yeah. Aside from all that info, leave the dreamy that ice cream. I appreciate you guys. It's Lil Kinky's birthday today, so everybody go on his IG and show that motherfucker some love. That's my bro. But yeah, man, peace out, guys, and I'll see y'all very, very soon. I'm gone. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life. I rules, and I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get.